Hello again! Welcome to another week on Mr. Pete's Road to Oz. So glad you came back to join us. Today I am on a river. Well, I'm actually on the bank of the river, but if the river, that is the mouth of it, it goes out to the ocean behind me. And uh, you can see the land on either side of it. And that, if you go out to that ocean and then you keep going straight ahead, you run into the main part of Australia. If you remember what it looks like on the map, where I am in Tasmania is an island. So uh, that means you, if you want to travel from anywhere else in Australia to get here, you have to either fly or come on a boat. Uh, and so one way of getting here is to go straight out this river and head north and you'll come to the main part of Australia. We call it the mainland. Now, I want to turn around and let's look the other way down the river and you will notice this big boat behind me. That, uh, that boat is called the Spirit of Tasmania and every day it sails over to Melbourne, which is the big city on the mainland. And it, it travels at night. So if you were going to catch this boat, this ferry, uh, you, you could drive your car, the car could go in the bottom of the boat, and then you could go up on the top. And uh, sometimes they have cabins where you can sleep in, or some chairs where you can just sit up, and you would sail all night. Uh, to get to the main part of, of Australia, to Melbourne, and uh, that would be quite an adventure. So I've done that before, and uh, but usually I fly, because it only takes about 50 minutes to fly from here, uh, from Tasmania to, to Melbourne, but you can't take your car on the boat, on, on the plane. Can't take your car on the plane. So if you want to take your car, like if you want to get there and then go driving a long way, you have to put your car on the boat, sail across the ocean, and uh, you, you go at night and get there early in the morning, and then you can drive to wherever else you want to go. So uh, this is uh, quite, a, quite a big river. Now the other thing you can see behind me is a little boat. Let's see if I can get my finger there. Right there, there's a little boat, and that is a ferry. It takes people from, uh, in this town, it takes people from one side of the river to the other side of the river. And it goes backwards and forwards all day. So uh, that's that's interesting. Uh, here, an interesting story that I, I heard is that just a, a few weeks ago, a big boat, not quite as big as this red and white one, but it crashed into some tugboats that were here in the river and the tugboats sank. And so later, uh, the other day I was driving past and I could look and uh, they had it marked where the where the tugboat sank. They're still there. They haven't got them out yet. I'm standing next to a lighthouse. Look at that. There's the lighthouse. And uh, of course that lighthouse is to make sure that the boats know where they're going and that they don't crash into the land. So uh, this is... Um, the boat is, uh, is uh, really important. It brings a lot of tourists, a lot of people here to Tasmania. And, uh, and it's very, very interesting. I'm wondering if you could tell me how many of you or have you ever been on a boat? Uh, so I don't go on a boat very often, but maybe you do. So I'd love for you to let, tell me in the comments down below, have you ever been on a boat? All right, I'm going to keep thinking of words that are new and uh, maybe we'll, next day or two I'll find a time to give you a lot of different words. But uh, when I don't have any for you today. So enjoy yourself and uh, welcome to a new week. We'll see you later. Now, 
we're around the other side of the boat and you can see how big it is it's a big boat in fact even these trucks over here are going to go on the boat and they'll go in the in the bottom of it so uh, it's a big boat and lots of people and lots of cars can fit on it That one doesn't have passengers. That's another boat. It just takes cargo across the water. So uh, it's blue. I don't know why. The blue is cargo and the red is passengers and cars.